Well, Tom Brokaw called them the greatest generation, the men and women who served the United States during World War II. Today, as our David Snyder reports, Plattsburgh Honor Flight took them to Washington to see the World War II Memorial with people paying respect along the way. It's a way where our community, community can come together and pay their respects and give credit to our past warriors of World War II. We, uh, most people have forgotten their sacrifices. Seventeen World War II veterans comprised Saturday's honor flight. I think it's a, a reawakening of their uh, self-worth. It started at Plattsburgh's U.S. Oval at sunrise, then proceeded to the airport. Speakers talked about the generation that risked their lives, made sacrifices few truly understand, not because of what was in it for them, but because it was the right thing to do. Honor Flight takes these people down to Washington to see the National World War II Memorial. Of course, the sidewalk's full of uh, pedestrians, and uh, they all line up and start plotting them. And uh, you look at the vets, and there's some of them got tears running down their eyes. and. They can't believe the reception they get because they don't think of themselves as heroes, even though we think of them as heroes. Honor flight organizers say it's so important to give World War II vets this opportunity. There's a resurgence of life and vitality is so great. An opportunity, organizers say, that's like none other. No other word than awesome. Uh, you, you, your heart feels good. You're, you feel a sense of pride, community unity. It's it's one of the best feelings you can have in today's world the way it is. It's, it's good to have this feeling. 